In 1935, Einstein wrote a paper that basically said, quantum mechanics is cheating. Not by being wrong at predicting experiments, by breaking a sacred rule of physics. No influence should travel faster than light. Here's the context. Relativity isn't just light is fast. It's a rule book for cause and effect. If something could act instantly across space, different observers could disagree about what caused what, and you get paradoxes. That's why Einstein rebuilt gravity as a moon local theory. Changes ripple outward at light speed. But quantum mechanics has a weird move called B wave function collapse. Measure a particle here, and the probabilities over there update instantly. Einstein thought, if that's real, it's spooky action at a distance. So he and colleagues proposed the EPR setup. Create two particles with linked properties. Entanglement. Measure one, and the other seems to know immediately, even far away. Einstein argued a local explanation must exist. Hidden variables. Preset instructions carried from the start. Then, decades later, John Bell found the trapdoor. If the world is local with hidden variables, there's a limit to how strong those correlations can be. Bell's inequality. Quantum mechanics predicts stronger correlations. Experiments tested it, and nature sided with quantum. Here's the punchline. Quantum correlations look faster than light, but you still can't use them to send messages. Results are random. So relativity survives the letter of the law, even if quantum violates the spirit. And if you want a mind-bending escape hatch, many worlds, removes collapse entirely. No instant updating, just branching outcomes. If you want the full story and what this means for reality, hit like, subscribe, and let's get spooky with physics.